In this video, we will learn how to create a properties table in a DITA reference topic. We will be using Oxygen XML Editor version 17 on a PC in Author View. Properties tables are allowed inside the RefBody element, so let's use Oxygen's properties wizard to set up the framework for our properties table. By default, the wizard gives us a properties table with one body row, which includes a prop type element, a prop value element, and a prop description element contained in a property element. However, your properties table can also have a header row. So let's add content to our properties table and then switch over to text view to see how this works in the code. The header row is contained by the prop head element, while each body row is contained by a property element. For the header row, we have the prop type head element, the prop value head element, and the prop description head element which are analogous to the prop type, prop value, and prop description elements in a body row. You don't need to have all three of these elements, type, value, and description, to have a complete row, but the elements you do use must occur in this strict sequence in order for your reference to be valid.